Well, hey everyone and welcome to the video. So the Saints Row reboot is nearing six months old already. How time has flown, like it is ridiculous. I can't believe that the game came out nearly six months ago. But the game hasn't had a ton of post-launch content, and quite frankly the game is still not in the best state. So today I want to suggest five things that I would do if I were Volition to pump some life back into Saints Row. Now, I know all these things aren't possible, and some of these things people may not like, but these are just my takes on what I would do if I were in Volition's shoes. Now again, I don't know things like the budget they have for this game, I don't know how doable certain things are, but if you can do these things, I don't see why you wouldn't. So, to start off with, I'm actually going to contradict something I said very recently, because after playing the reboot again, it really reminded me of how much a necessity this actually is, and that I disagree with what I said. So a while back, I said that I don't think multiplayer is even worth it for the reboot because the game is abandoned. But I completely take that back. A 4 player co-op or a multiplayer mode for the reboot would be fantastic. Having played through the reboot story very recently, there was blatantly some interiors that I would think are perfect for a very simple face-off mode for a multiplayer. Even if they were adding 2v2 or 3v3 team deathmatch type stuff. Now I'm not saying these rooms or interiors are perfect, but I don't see why if there are some pre-built assets we wouldn't have it. Now again, I'm not asking Saint Row to go fully GTA Online on me, but why are we still only able to play with two people? It's not enough for modern gaming. I have more than two friends. Shocker, I know, but I want to play with them. On top of that, multiplayer will keep the longevity of Saint Row alive so much. You would earn so much respect back in the community if a multiplayer mode is added. There is a lot of praise that will come from having a platform where you can play with your friends, not friend. I think that's pretty important. However, I do have to say, if this was to be done, one thing that is really needed is an improved and refined aiming and combat system. The combat system, at the moment, is okay. I don't mind the actual system of combat, where you have to do the executioners and stuff and the perks. I personally, and I know this is not the popular opinion, don't mind having to aim down sights, it's not very Saints Row but it's bearable. It's one of the things I do find some enjoyment in. However, I cannot find that enjoyment due to how the aiming feels. There is a weird aim acceleration and crazy dead zone, and I know you're probably thinking, we'll just turn it down in the settings. I do it, and not only does it often just randomly reset back to 30 dead zone, which is way too high as a standard, but on top of that, aim acceleration just feels wrong. I don't know what it is, but it feels like I'm fighting against my crosshair. Another thing I've noticed is that the crosshair when aiming down sights with a snap mode on will immediately aim above the character's head the second you start using a fully auto rifle, meaning that you have to literally burst fire your weapons in order to get any sort of accuracy. That is not satisfying, that is not what Saint Row is about. I love that we're making it a bit more of a modern shooter and trying to make it cooler, that's cool, but it's not for Saint Row. Saint Row doesn't need to be stuck in the past, but it does need to retain some of its critical key points it had as a series. And that very loose feeling aiming was one thing a lot of people did attribute to Saint Row. I don't mind the game trying to basically mimic GTA 5's pop shotting mechanics, but even GTA 5 is easier to be precise with aim assist. With aim assist, it's impossible to hit anything. With aim assist, you may hit something, but it's not satisfying. I can wholeheartedly say I've had pisses that are more accurate than my SMG accuracy. On top of that, I've also played shooting games on the Nintendo Wii, where I have better control of my weapons. This game is on modern consoles, why is it hard to aim? This really isn't an issue I've experienced in any other game. So, it's something I would personally like fixed. And all jokes aside, I think it would be a drastic improvement to the game. Next up is a big one. A really big one actually, and I'd say it's one of the core identities of Saints Row, and the fact it's not in this game makes me want to self-harm. Where are diversions? What? Like, okay, I understand that maybe at launch, with a new engine and a brand new system being brought in, that they may want to delay diversions a while. But we are now six months past release, and I can't vehicle surf, I can't rob stores, I can't rob NPCs, I can't go streaking, I can't do tagging, I can't take a taxi and be a taxi driver, I can't take a tow truck and do tow trucking, I can't keep hostages, I can't do minigames, I can't base jump, I can't barn stop, I can't even buy fucking stores! What happened? Well, technically, AJ, you seem to be mistaken. Don't you understand that with Criminal Ventures, you can build your own stores? Yeah, well, I don't care. I want to buy stores. It's part of the city takeover. It's how I feel like I own the streets. I don't want to build the streets. I understand that we're a criminal venture, but can't we take over some pre-existing businesses? I don't want to build everything myself. There is no satisfaction in building a toxic waste place instead of buying a local store. Where did it go? It was a key part of Saints Row. Ugh. Look, 
I know it's a new engine, and I know I sound like I'm being overly critical, but these are key parts of Saints Row. This adds a lot of replayability, and by not having these, we've got one of the most unreplayable games aside from the story. And the story, quite frankly, is not up to par for a lot of people. So by adding some of these things would really keep people playing. Okay, for the next one, I'm just gonna say this, okay? I don't like Trippy Red. Can we get some new music, please? Seriously, the music station in this game is so unbelievably lacking. It's got like two good stations, and one of them is the synth wave, and the other one is having the radio turned off. So, like, come on. Can we not get some new music? Where is the mix? I like the mix. Where is Gen X? And I'm not asking for the actual stations to come back, but I would just like some of the music taste. What happened to Volition? You guys used to be cool. What happened to the good music, man? Where's the mix? What happened? I'd rather have your wubba wubba dubstep come back. And finally, last and honestly probably least, but it's still important, where are the planes? Now, Santo Aleso is beautiful. Flying around in a VTOL has never been so good. Besides the flight controls, but that's another issue. But honestly, where are the rest of the planes? Flying around is one of the most fun things to do in Saints Row. You can have a ton of fun messing around with planes, and only having one VTOL is kind of disappointing. Now, I can understand the excuse of we have a wingsuit, and that kind of makes planes semi-redundant, and that's a fair excuse, to be honest. But I don't see why we wouldn't have some planes even a couple. I would accept one more plane. Like, literally, if we have one plane in the game, I think I would be happy. But having no planes at all, a little disappointing. Now, that doesn't mean only add one plane, because if you're going to add planes, you can add a couple. Come on, let's not try and be too hasty here. But I would definitely like to see some planes added. I don't see why they're not in the game. They can only add some more fun. Anyway, I know everyone's going to be commenting right now, AJ, you forgot to talk about the story. Yeah, well, the DLC's coming out. I'll complain about the story after that, okay? Calm down. Put your pitchforks down. In all seriousness, though, I'm not going to really talk about story too much in this video because we have got the DLC on the way. There is more story stuff on the way. So these are my recommendations of what I would like to see added to Saints Row. I hope you enjoyed this video. And whilst this was quite a meme -y video and I was just making meme -y points, I do think that the things I listed are really important and they should come back. Stay safe, everyone. Have a good day. And yeah. Bye. Actually, no. Watch my Central 1 playthrough. It's on the way. Yeah. Bye.